Business Beat reporter Meredith McCunes recently visited the Callahan Center to look around the Heritage Gallery. We are here at the Callahan Center to learn more about their hidden gem, the Heritage Gallery. Uh, the Heritage Gallery is actually a very key part of the Callahan Center and has been for many decades, going back to Evelyn Langley, who managed the um, store many years ago and also started the Friends of Callahan. Uh, Mark now, in his role as president of the Friends of Callahan, sort of kept things going. And it's a very key part of the Callahan Center. It adds its own special flavor, and it makes the Callahan Center different from many other senior centers. The Heritage Gallery um, is a consignment shop. We have different consigners who come in with different items. Uh, the strongest portion of our gallery today has been our jewelry, which is a wonderful collection of jewels, of earrings, rings, bracelets, and other ornamental items that people uh, find very attractive. It is uh, over 50% of our business. It's a very large uh, shop. We're a little bit bigger than some other places. Uh, there are uh, pieces like glassware and china that you can purchase as well for your home. So it has a number of items as, as well as gift cards that they sell here. The proceeds go right back into uh, programming. Um, there are some of the different activities in the center. There's some uh, classes in craft making, beading, that type of programming. And those programs are free to people who come to the center. I discover that the gallery has a little creativity that catches your eye. The windows display started, uh, actually Mark Goldman had the idea of, he came to me and said, how about a window display to make it a little bit more attractive and decorative? So we started last year and every holiday, virtually every month, we changed the window displays. We've been able to create different attractive ideas in the window. It's the beauty and the cuteness and there's the creativity of being able to attract people. I found that Mark and Frank have future plans for local artists. I'd love to see the Heritage Gallery move from being its current format of mainly being consigner items and donated items for people to being more of a combination of what, a little bit of what you see today, but also moving to support the local artisans in the area. We're looking and working over the last couple months to try and develop a new concept called an artist gallery. And what we're going to be doing is taking uh, pictures, glassware, jewelry, and products of that nature and trying to increase the demographics of people coming into the center. Uh, I know for the town of Framingham, the future has designs for a cultural community. We're right up the road from their cultural center for the future, uh, where the Village Green is located. And then if you go all the way to downtown for the Amazing Things Art Center, um, that cultural district goes all the way from the Village Green to downtown Framingham. The Callahan Center and the Heritage Gallery is right in the middle of that cultural district. For the Business Beat, I'm Meredith McCunis.